and Rangers International. Before the end of the show, if we could get it, I'm going to actually show you that particular game because it ended in a very fantastic, uh, on a very fantastic note. Rangers were trailing initially and they came back and they actually got the better of Kano the last. It ended in a penalty shootout and Rangers winning by four goals after two. And away from that, let's talk, quickly talk about um, uh, athletics this particular time. I'm talking about uh, Falilat Ogunkoya being the flag bearer of the 2019 Wari Ephraim Peace Marathon activities. Well, actually, it will be taking a center stage on the 30th of this month, uh, uh, trying to campaign for what will be seen come next year in the marathon. Stephen Abiyo. Yeah, for me, it is a good thing. And when we talk about, when we are talking about athletics in Nigeria, I think Falila Togokoya is one face we all can recognize and reckon with. So for her to flag up that, I think it's a good thing. And also, you know, it, uh, it's something that I want to use to draw out support and also a sponsorship for the for the game. So for me, I think it's a good thing. But well, it's a good one coming from Falila Togokoya. I just want to have your reaction to this particular marathon we are getting year in, year out. And the Nigerian sports field. Lagos has a marathon. Uh, Delta has a marathon. Uh, Edo has a marathon. Abuja has a marathon. And we keep seeing marathon. And that of Lagos now is Silver Marathon. Silver uh, 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 Great Marathon. The one they had this year. Maybe next year they are going to be promote, promoted to the, uh, uh, the category here. What, what, what is your think about all this marathon we are having year in, year out in Nigeria? I think it's a good one. Um... You know, don't forget marathon. I mean, it's part of those events that takes place on uh, in the Olympics of and course. all that. And uh, but we've not really been, uh, we've not, we have not really done well when it comes to marathon. marathon. Of course, of even the even the, but, go no, the government of Lagos City, they are trying to set aside a, a, a training camp for those that have yeah. interest in that long distance. Yeah, I, I think I think it's a good one. And if you keep on doing it, I think someday. You might have those that will do very well. I mean, that will represent Nigeria and they will do and they'll bring weather through marathon, you know, on the, in the international games. Okay, yeah. talking about uh, we will be getting those that were doing well in the long distance race for Nigeria. Remember, since inception of the Lagos Marathon, it has always been a uh, Kenya coming to take all the accolades. But if I thought we can work very hard and make sure that. We very start our name among the best and among the highlights when it comes to our uh, distance race in Africa, and not just in Africa, I know, as well as uh, in the world. And still talking about all the sport this afternoon, let's quickly talk about basketball. LeBron James, the king, is back on the court, and it was fantastic. Uh, just, let, let's, let us quickly talk about LeBron James, his, uh, he, he, what he has been doing over the years and what he has continued doing. I want to quickly have your take on that. You know, you know, LeBron James, as we know, when we measure basketball, it's like we are measuring LeBron James. Of course. Of so course. definitely, he the is king, a fantastic player. James. That's why he's called the king. LeBron, the king, James. Of course. So, uh, you know, he just left Piblas Cavalier to another club. And even with that, you know, starting the season, he has shown what he's capable of doing. And he, he seems not to want to stop, despite everything that has been done to stop him. He also played a lot. He also he played against against Steve Curry. Of course. I think in the uh, some yes, not just yesterday. No, Steve Curry got fifty one points with that ball. Uh, uh, well, know, he had for the city. He had, he had for he doesn't a fantastic one for him. It's a fantastic one for him. But you know, you know LeBron James. You know what he's capable of doing. He's just starting up in a new club. So what do you expect? He's going to. He has to familiarize. He's going to be very team. tough. He's going to be tough. But definitely, you know, for him starting and still getting for three points, definitely he still got a lot inside him to give out. Oh, he still has a whole lot to actually give the world of basketball but let's take a look at the top 10 of basketball talking about october 25th night the games we saw but we'll talk about the top 10 dogs in those games and after that sports speech will continue <laughs> 